basically have 30 days to get my subscribership up. And I'm dedicating all 30 days to do that. So stay tuned. You're going to see a lot more of me than you probably ever want to. So, you guys are probably wondering why I'm in the shower. Well, I've been doing this YouTube thing for about five years as a side gig. Never really took it that serious. I figure I have 30 days off, so why not just try to give it my all for 30 days and see what happens with it. Uh, the shower scene, I figured it worked for very few, so why would it work for me? A Central Park in fall. How you toy a dress. What a mess. Well, one thing I'm doing since I have all this time off is to make a valiant effort to go to the gym. The gym and I have a love-hate relationship. Um, I was a professional baseball player for a short period of time and I spent a lot of time in a gym working out. Well, about three years ago I got diagnosed with diabetes and found out that you can't just eat crappy food and live like a pig. It will catch up to you. Plus it's hereditary so I'm not really sure how I got it but this 30 days is also to make a better effort at taking care of myself and getting these diabetes under control. Hey Cash, you need anything? You good? All right, dude, I'm gonna go to the gym. Peace out. Don't get up, just hang there. Okay, that was tough. Also, because I'm a diabetic, I have to drink these things. I'm not sure if you can see those or not. Lighting's kind of bad. Atkins protein shakes. The one thing I do like about these are they're actually kind of tasty, believe it or not. I'm not sponsored by Atkins, but Atkins, call me if you need something. I'll throw you a plug every now and then. Get back from the gym. I'm exhausted. Uh, the gym kicks my butt every time. Again, it's like a love-hate relationship with that place. I try my hardest to just knock it out and get it done, but inevitably I come home and I'm just exhausted. It is freezing cold here in Cincinnati. Uh, it's about 28 degrees. There's about an inch of snow on the ground. I am so over the snow. This year has just been completely awful with the weather. Uh, and I think it's just because we're noticing it more because we're all at home a little bit more. But man, it is just January, February, basically the end of December, January, February, and almost through March. It's just like gray here. There's nothing to look forward to with the weather at all. So luckily, I've been able to go to Florida a couple times just to kind of get a feel for the sun, which uh, this week I am heading to Fort Lauderdale. So it should be a good trip. Anyway, so uh, we're jumping on the rest of the day here. Got a few emails to answer. Got a few things I got to take care of for work. But uh, other than that, I will uh, keep you guys posted. And we're going to do a little office tour here in just a few minutes. Hello. Go outside. Yeah, I'll try.
full. Go, go inside. Gas, go inside. So let's talk about the studio and what is all in here. Bam. Well, like many of you guys that do YouTube, you have to get everything that you need to make it actually worth doing. And over time, you pick up quite a few things. Um, so I guess let's just start with uh, what I edit with. I have a MacBook Mini there. Uh, I have an LG monitor, real wide monitor. Bought that stand off Amazon, which works out real well for uh, actual editing. You can see here, I made this iron rod stand for overhead shots, which works out real well if you're doing something. And then I have a mat down here that, um, that I can place anything on. Um, got two lights here, uh, the, the newer lights, uh, they're actually brand name is newer, very inexpensive, um, I think they're about 150 bucks, but that definitely lights up my room a little bit better than just this light right here, because that's all I have as far as the, uh, this, the lighting down here, it's kind of awful. Uh, then I made some, uh, sound acoustic, uh, boards to uh, hang on the wall there just to give me a little bit better sound in here because there is quite a bit of an echo we have this uh like this vinyl flooring here that just everything echoes off through a little piece of walmart carpet in here i have a chair my ugly chair i call it from uh, some of my old videos you'll see in my old place i used to sit on that thing all the time now it just collects junk for the most part and this is actually our basement slash laundry room so uh, have the ability to do some podcasting, have a pile mixer there. Um, and then I also use the Rode uh, pod mic uh, to do all my audio stuff. Um, everything's wireless minus the um, mixer there. And then this light right here is just a, um, I don't know if you can see it or not, I don't have it on. But just to kind of give me some uh, fill lighting there. And then I have my old TV hung up here, and then all my all my uh, stands and whatnot right there. Uh, and then guitar and ukulele. Uh, I used to play a lot of guitar. I don't play as much anymore. But yeah, so that's the studio. Uh, may not look super awesome, but when you're shooting YouTube videos and you're on a budget, I think I did a pretty good job. If uh, you guys got any questions about how I made something or uh, those acoustics panels are pretty cool. I watched a couple YouTube videos and learned how to make them and actually got to make some more probably because there's still a bit of an echo in here. But uh, yeah, and then also got the fridge right down here. That's where we put all of our alcohol, which doesn't hold that much. So it barely ever is filled, to be honest with you. And then I bought these little panels right here on Amazon just to kind of help absorb some more of the sound. I don't really think they do anything though. Um, cause if you can hear, there's still quite a bit of an echo in here. Anyway, that is the studio. So the day's over, as you can hear, I'm doing some laundry in the background. Uh, pretty much after, uh, to give you guys a tour, just ate dinner, didn't really do anything that exciting. Uh, what you're going to learn real quick in these vlogs is I'm not that exciting of a person. Uh, I think as you get older, you kind of just, you know, settle down a little bit. But the one thing I do notice is when the weather's really bad, that doesn't help anything. So how this is going to work is I have 30 days off and I'd like to do five videos a week. 
how those videos roll out. I'm going to try to have a video out every night by 12 o'clock. So if you guys are watching and looking for constant content and just want to watch the whole thing through, uh, they'll be up probably around 1230 at night. Um, and then you get to watch them all the next day. Anyway, guys, I appreciate any support that you can give me. Subscribe. Very, I need all the subscribers I can get. It's huge right now. And uh, I hope that you guys stay tuned for this 30-day challenge that I'm putting up for myself. And uh, we'll catch you tomorrow. Peace.